Will Ferrell went to the University of Southern California. He was hoping to become a sports broadcaster. I am an anchor man. But during one of his broadcasting courses, he ad-libbed a joke on air. And when people saw that, well, he was urged to give comedy a whirl. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh. By 1995, Will was cast on Saturday Night Live and quickly became an audience favorite. He had popular characters like Craig the Spartan Cheerleader, George W. Bush, Robert Goulet, James Lipton, uh, nightclubber Steve Butabi, and of course, there's a, there's a more cowbell routine. I need more cowbell. Those characters made him the highest paid Saturday Night Live cast member ever earning $350,000 a year. Is that it? That's all you got? What? Since then, he's gone on to star in loads of Hollywood hits. Elf, Anchorman, Old School, Bewitched, Stranger Than Fiction, Talladega Nights. Uh, okay, maybe Bewitched wasn't such a hit. <laughs> Forbes, by the way, named him one of the top grossing comedians. In 2005, Will earned a reported $40 million. His latest movie, Blades of Glory, opens April 13th. Oh, and he just nails the triple axle! Surfing a tsunami of swagger right now. Hello, ladies. Typical of Michaels, it's not enough just to win. He wants to make love to the crowd. That was disgusting. That young man is how babies are made. What is that for? This uh, make poverty history. And I yes. noticed because you are pro poverty, I've noticed. I'm very pro poverty. You know, that's thing. Everybody, Will Ferrell, how are you? I'm great. Life's good? No complaints. Figure skating, man? Yes. How'd that work out My for new you? passion. <laughs> new passion. It could, worked out pretty good. Could you skate before? Did you ever watch it growing up? I mean, Southern California, is it big down there? Uh, not really. No, I think I skated maybe three times. Uh, and I had to, I'd forgotten that I'd learned to skate a little bit for the movie Elf. There's a little skating scene in there. But other than those four experiences, I'd never skated. Well, at least you had actually been an Elf before. Uh, you know, in your career. Right, and that's kind of an elf and activity, you would think. When you, when you walk into this, and I mean, because obviously you're a successful guy in terms of, in, in films and comedy and TV, do people, can you be directed in that character? You know, can people say, yeah, well, you went too far, that's not the right one. I'm very obstinate. Uh, <laughs> I do not, I usually say, talk to the hand, mm -hmm. which is an old phrase right. and out, very outdated, but. It's retro, it's coming. Yeah, I still say it. Mm -hmm. And uh, no, I mean, I, I you know, I love hearing direction. I'm always, you know, because you, you always get, uh, for me, the best idea wins. So regardless of who's kind of giving it to me and, and uh, that sort of thing, it's, I, I always remain very open to, to all of that stuff. And at the same time, uh, at this stage of the game, at least, a lot of directors are like, whatever you think, whatever you want to do. So that's. That's the luxury of both. Do you, do you like that? I mean, because I wonder with, with that kind of freedom that there's probably. I, d I do, and yet sometimes I, I uh, you know, it's. I think you can have very hit or miss days on a movie set where you're having a great day and everything's clicking. And other days, just nothing's coming to your mind. And so, on those days when when a director is saying, "Yeah, <laughs> go for it," and nothing's <laughs> happening, I do feel. You're like, is this thing on? Anybody like, laugh at me? Oh, sorry. Actors always talk about how it, they draw from within themselves for a role sometimes. And I always wonder if that was true for comedy actors, if you do funny movies. I, you know, I don't know if it happens so much for me, just because, uh, I mean, I do obviously commit to the character, and I... I do you I'm walk around firm. like Chaz, is that your bit? When you not, <laughs> I mean, uh, not really. No. <laughs> <laughs> Which is probably good for people in your yeah, life. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but it's, you know, it, it's fun to uh, obviously dive into the character and commit to it wholeheartedly. Um, but... Uh, you know, I didn't watch hours of figure skating tapes to prepare for the role, uh, which <laughs> I think actually kind of helps because then I bring this awkward sensibility to 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 a world that mm -hmm. that doesn't probably have it. So it's it kind of mixes well that way. It's real skaters there. Yeah, Some top top notch yeah. figure skaters. Top notch. Did yes. They, did they talk to you? They did. They were. Uh, I have to say that the figure skating world embraced us. Uh, <laughs> they were so excited about this movie and and have such. Uh, you know, they obviously know that it's one of the hardest sports, and and you have to train a lifetime for mm -hmm. one moment that you either hit or miss. And uh, and yet they have a real kind of great sense of humor about how over the top the sport is. And and so they were. They couldn't have been cooler. I wonder how, how, how you make choices in terms of comedies, because comedies are almost impossible to predict right. when you read a script, because yeah. the yeah. words aren't enough, right? I don't, that's why I just close my eyes 
and uh, <laughs> <laughs> reach into a bag and go, this one. Do you, do you like getting older as an actor? Is it better for you? Um, I actually feel like I'm getting younger. Um, I know it doesn't look that way. Uh, I mean, I've spent a lot of money up here mm -hmm. and down here mm -hmm. for the butt implants. Does parenting change the way you pick films? Uh, it hasn't yet. It hasn't yet. I don't know if, as my kids get older, if, if they make a comment positively or negatively about something I'm, I did or I'm about to do, if that will mm -hmm. influence me in a way to, to be like, oh gosh, I don't, they, that, that really affected them. I don't want to do that type of movie anymore. That, that could happen, or, uh, but uh, thus far, I, I, I don't really let that influence anything. If it happens, you just tell them to shut up yeah, and enjoy exactly. the ride. Just shut your mouth. Okay. <laughs> nice to see you. Nice to see you. Thanks, I appreciate it.